Hello everyone, welcome to another Exchange 2013-2019 coexistence video. And in today we're looking at part 14 of 18, which is updating your SEND connector. So I have already logged into the Exchange Admin Center here and clicked on Mailflow on the left here and then on Send Connectors and this brings up our Send Connector here. If I double click the Send Connector, I want to add the 2019 server that I have and remove the 2013 server. So what do I do? I go to the scoping section and on the bottom here, I can click the plus button for the source server. Double click the Exchange 2019 server, click OK, and then highlight the 2013 server, click on the minus button, and then once it removes from the list, sorry, my system's a bit slow, you can click save, and now it will only have the 2019 server. So all mail will now route through the send connector only through the 2019 server. If you want to double check this, you can open up again and click on scoping and you see we only have our 2019 server. If for some reason you find that stuff stops working and you need to troubleshoot, you can always come back and click the plus button like we have here and then you can double click the 2013 server, click OK again, click save. <clears throat> It'll take a moment to update and then give it a few minutes to update in the back end with all the changes and then the mail will start routing again if you have any issues. So it's a short part video this and in the next part we'll be looking at working on our receive connectors and copying our receive connectors from the one to the other one if you had any custom. So I'll be doing that. So see you in part 15. Thank you very much for watching.